What is up the world? It is your friendly neighborhood slipgator here and today I'm going to show you how to build this simple starter treehouse. Stay tuned! Alright guys, today we're going to be talking about a simple starter treehouse and I'm pretty excited. It's going to be kind of a, a cool little build, little tiny build, but uh, still really, really cool. We got a really cool seed here. I just loaded this world up and this is what we got. It's kind of a neat seed. There's like a little cave down under here. It might be good for like a survival LP. I'll see. If I remember, I'll put the seed in the down there. So I already built some some big trees here. I'll show you how to do that in a second. Then I want to make sure you got we got Kevin over here hanging out. What up, Kevin? And we're going to do, as we always do, start off with a... Uh, a uh, a scale model. Let me go ahead and grab some oak leaves. This is pretty much what it's going to look like. Yep. Like that. That's what we're going to be building. Just so you know. So that way we can look up at it in a second here. And uh, we can compare. It's going to be the best. So to make a big tree. Let's go ahead and go up like say five. Put a piece of dirt. Come out two. Go up four. Like so. So now you got four right here. Go ahead and put up four torches. There's a couple of different ways to do this. This is the way I've just always done it. Now you have to bone meal the heck out of this thing after you start doing this. Sometimes it takes just an instant. Sometimes it takes forever. There you go. Then take out your dirt and your torches. Go ahead and place a, place a piece of oak wood back in. Look at that. Bam, you got your tree. You got your good tree. All right, so up here, we're going to start doing our treehouse. Let's put up our roof first. We're going to take from the topmost leaf, and we're going to go down two blocks. We're going to do a three by three around this thing, like so. And on two of the sides, let me see here. What sides should we, should we use? Let's go this way. We're going to go out one more block like this. Because the idea is what we're trying to do is we're trying to make a five by seven. So let's do like this. We're going to make our ceiling first on this thing. Let's pop that out like that. And then we're just going to go all the way around with spruce stairs. Like so. And we're going to make like a little, you know, the little roof part. And the reason we're starting from our roof is because it doesn't really matter how far away from the ground we are for this, for this build. But it does matter how far we are from the top because we're going to put a little trap door up here so you can get up. All right. So there we got that. Let's go ahead and head down. Um, should we just make it too high? Yeah, no, probably three high. One, so one, two, three. And then down here, we're gonna do the exact same thing. So now we have like a three high house. Do a three by three like so. Out on this side and out on this side. And we're gonna take our spruce stairs and we're gonna do these upside down. It's a little bit easier because this time we can place them against the slabs as opposed to placing them against the stairs. Like this, like this, and like that. All right, bam. So when you walk up here, squirt, and then we're going to go ahead and get some ladders. And then there you go. Now you come up, and we've already basically done it. It's already pretty much almost done. All right, maybe not. All right, so let's take our trap door. Let's grab that. Let's squirt a trap door down right there. Then on the other side here, let's go ahead and take our ladders, go up, poke a hole, bam, one of these, head up to the top, put down a trap door. There, bam, we're basically already done. Kind of, sort of. All right, watch this. So we're gonna take some oak wood on the sides. We're gonna go all the way up, give it a frame, give it a support, like so, okay? Now let's get some oak stairs. I think we're gonna use a lot of oak wood for the rest of the interior here. So we're gonna take our oak stairs and on the inside, let's place oak stairs like so. We're gonna do a little bit of editing of this as we go. So, but for now, let's just place oak stairs all the way around like that, I think. I think maybe. We'll see. So then on the top, what we're gonna do, yeah. All right, so from the outside, place upside down stairs like so. And then what this is gonna do, you'll see once we once we switch it, I think some of these blocks are gonna get switched out for solid blocks. But for now, this is gonna be great. All right, so then what we're gonna do eventually is maybe do some changing around of stuff and things. So we need a little bit of a deck. Let's take some spruce slabs. And let's make a deck on side on the side over here. Let's go out just three. Like so. It's probably gonna need to be supported. So let's grab some fence blocks. Fence blocks, fence posts. 
And then from the very corners here, we'll come down to the ground, wherever the ground may be. Like so. Let's just pop that off. It'll look a little bit better that way. And then we'll grab some more spruce, the spruce uh, planks and, uh, or pardon me, slabs, and we'll, we'll squirt those down in the corners. All right, so we got the beginnings of a something something happening. Let's go up inside here and take a look. Oh, you know what we got to do? We got to take our trapdoor, actually. Put it against the other side so it opens like that. That's going to work a lot better. Oh, up here we're going to have to do it like that. It'll work out. It'll be good. All right, so inside... Let's go ahead and start looking at getting our windows done. Let's pop these corners out. That isn't going to work out for us very good. Um, on the tops, though, let's go with upside down stairs on the inside. Yeah, that's better. All right, like this, like this, like that, and like that. Let's do that on all the corners. I think this is going to look great. I, we'll see. We shall see. All right, like so, and like so, like so, like that. We'll do some oak wood all the way up in here. Like this, like this, like this, like this, like that. Let's put that down. All right, so now we got a thing happening. Now over here, we've got this this area out here. We've gotta go ahead and get a door on this. So we've got our upside downs like that. Okay, let's go ahead and take, just grab an oak door. We'll squirt it down right here. Bam, it's a thing. So now these are almost like, see, these are almost like little, um, like shelves maybe for the inside so you can stick stuff and things up in there for when you're hanging out and you're doing stuff and things inside of your treehouse let's grab some panes and we'll squirt glass panes in here and here and here over here over here over here and right there so now if we head out let's just take a look at it from the outside too and see what she looks like so yeah, it's got a little bit of detail with the stair, the upside down stairs there. We got some contrast with the spruce on the top and the bottom like that. It's kind of looking like it's a thing. You know, this definitely needs something, something. Let's grab some fence posts like this. Um, you know what, actually, it would be kind of neat. Let's do a little bit of an overhang on this side. Just go out one block like that. And then how about a chair? Hmm, let me see here. Let's use ch uh, jungle wood. Let's use jungle wood. We'll do a jungle wood seat. And then we'll actually do an upside down one there. A little table like that. Check this out. Then we'll use a flower pot. Make it beautiful for when you come out here in the mornings. Let's stick a daisy in there. Like this. Nice. Now when you come out here to hang, it's going to look really nice. You know, we can actually push a couple torches right there and right there. Now on the inside, let's go back in. Go ahead and turn that down. Let's do some torches here and here. Really well lit up. Oh, my tree. Oh, my door. Oh, my door. And we'll pop our door back on. That's part of the build. Make sure you destroy that and re then rebuild it. Um, you know what else we're going to need up inside of here, too? Maybe like a crafting table and a furnace. Because it's like a starter house. You know what I mean? So we just need a crafting table and a furnace. Put a crafting table right here. We're a little pressed for space. A little furnace right there. And you know what? Maybe we'll do... That's like that's a nice little area for a seat right there. Maybe over here is where we'll do our storage chests. So we'll just take a chest, squirt one down right there and right there. Now up here, you can still come up. I like the trapdoor the way that it is like that. And you know when you're a kid and you're building a treehouse, you know, you got to have something dangerous. So this is a very dangerous treehouse. So if you climb up on the top of here, I mean, you can just fall right off. you got to be pretty careful if you're going into this danger treehouse. So we got a little bit of detail on the inside. I like how these little oak posts poke out. They're just kind of like a something something. Got a little bit of kind of a couple seating areas, a couple places for some storage for shelves. Then you come down and you got your stuff and things out here like this. And that's it. It's really simple. Just wanted to do a simple design for a modern treehouse. I hope you guys like it. If you liked the video, make sure you hit the like button. Just do a quick one today. Feel free to share and favorite as you see fit. There's also more great videos all about different tutorials and building stuff that I've done. And the links are in the down there in the description, so check it out. So yeah, thanks for watching, and may the stuff and things be with you.